welcome to the first annual Comics Mini Hot Dog Eating Competition. Quite a selection of competitors we have now. First of all, we have Adira Amram. Uh, Sean, what do you know about Adira? Well, Adira is the hometown girl done good. She's a native here in Chelsea and is no stranger to the art of meat packing. And then, of course, the young out of nowhere, H. Allen Scott. What can you tell me about H. Allen? We have very little to go on. He is the David in this David V. Goliath scenario, but instead of a stone in his sling, it will be meat, and instead of shooting that meat at Goliath, he'll be putting it into his mouth. And of course, lest we forget, Lord Andre Duboucher. Impossible. Mm. European title champion and the man to beat. Uh, and keep in mind that Andre, as a European, uses the metric system, so that's going to be confusing as well because one miniature hot dog to him is like 20 to us. True, true, true. Larger than life personalities who love smaller than life food. Well, it looks like the competition is about to get started. Let's go. Time to dig in. And we're off. Looks like Adira Amram's out to a strong start. Newcomer H. Allen Scott. Oh, well, buns. I don't do buns. Off to a bit of a shaky start. Lord Andre also doing very well. See, he has a more methodical, almost psychological approach to this competition. I spoke to him earlier about what he was expecting in today's matchup. Adira Amram and H. Allen Scott, um, any sort of fear there? Do you, any intimidation? Fear. Yes, on your part. No, yes, they should be scared. No, I mean yes. you. Are you scared of them at all? Am I scared that how well I might do? Yes. I am scared that I might win to such an extent that they will give up not only on competitive eating, but on life. And there you have it. But it remains to be seen if the legend will continue here today. So far, Adira Amram has pulled into an early lead, <laughs> but she is showing some signs of fatigue. While the battle rages on, let's go to a man who obviously can stand the heat, because Sean Crespo's in the kitchen. Here we are in the nerve center of competitive miniature hot dog eating. Derek, what goes in to a pig in a blanket? Well, a pig in a blanket? A veritable dream factory down here. You're telling me, Sean. Things are getting fierce out here in front of comics. Adira Amram soldiering on even as her competitors continue to narrow the gap. Let's meet this little firecracker. I understand today's competition means something a little extra special to you. It actually, it does. Today's uh, performance and eating, I uh, would like to dedicate to our troops, especially those ones that are not in Iraq. Adira, many people out there are suggesting that the favorite in today's competition is Andre Duboucher. No. Your opinion? No, he's not. And you know what I have to say to him? My country is of the land of the house. yeah, yeah. Well, if that doesn't get your hand on your heart, I don't know what will. But it remains to be seen if America's sweetheart is going to pull this one out, because there's a young buck in her tail, and he's threatening to take the lead. At what point did you realize that you were what they would call a... Uh, a wiener enthusiast? Sure. Yeah, well, it started as a young child, you see. My mom used to make these cheese-filled hot dogs with the cheese in the middle. I and think I see where this I is would, going. I would squirt them out so the cheese would just squirt right at me. Just... Here they come down the home stretch. Ladies and gentlemen, this looks to be a photo finish. Boy, oh boy, what a cup. Wait, wait a second. What is going on with the deer of Amram? She appears to be getting assistance from H. Allen Scott who's either administering the Heimlich Maneuver or has made a lifestyle change. Meanwhile, Duboucher, ever the professional, remains focused on the food. Please, there are other... Holy schmoly, Amram has vomited a hot dog. I'm getting the official ruling. Yes, Adira Amram has been disqualified. Likewise, H. Allen Scott has been disqualified for failure to eat his buns. So ladies and gentlemen, that means our winner is once again, Lord Andre Duboucher. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to present the winner of the first annual comics mini hot dog eating competition, Lord Andre Duboucher. Lord Andre, congratulations. And here is the ceremonial cup o' pig. Any final words of wisdom? Yes, yes. Uh, hey, kids, always follow your dreams. Uh, but make sure that you pick an easy dream. This was fairly easy for me to accomplish, I have to say. Well, there you have it, folks. Thanks for watching the first annual comics mini hot dog eating competition. Good day and bon appetit. <laughs>